Hey guys, today we have a big change coming to my 120 gallon Mbuna tank. I'm really excited to share with you the process. So we're going to be adding two new types of Mbuna to this tank. Now as you know I've had these guys uh, in here for quite a while. Uh, they're doing fantastic, lots of breeding. It's also my display tank. And unfortunately I can't keep all of the Mbuna that I have. So two groups of Mbuna are going to be taken out of here to exchange them with the new fish. So can't wait to show you guys how the tank looks and show you guys the new fish. So I'm going to get started and we'll come back when everything is done and all the fish are settled in and I'll show you how the tank looks. All right guys, so here's a look at the tank all finished. Uh, it's only been about two days since I did the big switch. So I ended up taking out uh, 12 fish and adding 23 new ones. So the fish that got removed were seven uh, yellow labs and my little group of five jallow reef. So they'll be moving on to a new home. And the fish that I added are a group of white top hara and also a group of Metriaclima eusissii. So really happy with how it's turned out. Uh, the fish are doing amazing. The tank is very lively. Um, a lot of uh, activity in this tank for sure. Um, it looks great. I love the addition of, you know, kind of a bigger group of fish. Uh, some of these guys are a little bit small still, so there's a little bit of room to grow and maybe at some point, you know, I may have to thin out the tank a little bit as, uh, you know, I kind of get them growing and kind of uh, establish uh, the males and the females. Uh, but overall right now I'm just loving how it looks and I'm loving how the tank is really full of a lot of activity. Uh, there's been a lot of breeding activity both from uh, the fish that were already in here and also from the, the new fish. So that's been great to see. And uh, so far you know uh, the fish are still kind of establishing some territories but um, you know overall everybody is doing excellent. Uh, the move was a complete success and uh, everybody looks happy and healthy. So another thing that I did to the tank is I did a little bit of a, a rearrangement um, of the scape and I added just a piece of fake wood that I had laying around and uh, you know I kind of like the look of it. I think it looks alright. I might kind of mess around with it a little bit more and uh, you know see if I can get it looking a little bit better but overall I'm really happy with it and uh, just can't stop taking my eyes off this tank uh, just loved how it's uh, turned out so far so I'm just gonna grab the camera here and we'll get a closer look at some of the new fish alright so right here in the middle of the screen chasing everybody around is one of the dominant white top haras and uh, had these guys before but absolutely love these fish the males are so beautiful uh, they're nice and bright that nice kind of powdery blue so really cool fish uh, like I said I have a nice group of 13 I uh, already do have uh, a small batch of fry from them so that's great news and uh, as you can see this guy is loving life in this tank um, he's kind of taken over that one little spot there and uh, dancing around for the females and chasing everybody out of his area so that's always good to see there's actually a couple of uh, dominant males in here there's one on this side and there's also another male right over here uh, in this pile of rocks and he's kind of uh, the boss of this territory So again, these guys are doing great. And the other type of fish that I added are the Metriaclima eusissii. Let's just see if we can get a look at one of the males kind of fired up. Just got to find them here. All right, so here's a look at one of the males. So I picked these guys up because uh, they're a little bit rare around this area. Um, you don't see them out uh, out in the stores or out around anywhere so just uh, you know I saw this group and they looked amazing I uh, just thought they'd be kind of a cool little pickup uh, see if we can get some breeding from these guys and uh, hopefully 
Uh, some of the other hobbyists around the area will like them. But again, a nice big healthy group of 13 in here. So we'll see how, uh, you know, as they grow. There's quite a few smaller ones as well. You can see over here, uh, we've got a couple smaller guys here. And, uh, you know, as they grow up, we'll just kind of see how, um, how the male to female ratio is. But for right now, there's uh, plenty of room in this tank. And uh, they're doing really well. So this here's another shot of one of the males. Just kind of... Uh, starting to color up a little bit and these guys are also dancing around quite a bit uh, showing off for the females uh, looking like they're uh, maybe thinking about breeding so that's great news yeah, kind of a cool little fish we're just gonna back off here and we'll give you a little bit better of a view of the tank overall So yeah, just loving the way this tank has turned out. Uh, leave me a comment. Let me know what you guys think. And uh, hit like if you like this video. Hit subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. And uh, thanks a lot for watching, guys. And we'll see you again real soon.